Hello. I've come to talk about an issue about blades. Today's issue is about blades. This is a size 4 blade, Macintosh. And this is a size 3 blade. I'm going to tell you this. Let me give you some advice. No matter what your attending tells you, your senior tells you, unless you practice with it in the mannequin and the cadaver or in the OR, you will never know what blade is the best blade for you unless you practice with it. And I'm going to tell you, the majority of times, I intubate with this blade. Right? I intubate with this blade because most people in America are between 5 to 6 feet tall. Those that are longer, more distal, size 4. Make sense? The blade itself does not make you intubate better. People have this idea they have weak arms or a short petite stature and they're not that strong because they don't work out. They have flabby arms. They'd rather use a big blade and see if that blade will compensate for their weakness or their lack of skill and finesse, aka intubation talent. All you need is finesse and belief and you will do better using whichever blade you're best at. And guess what? Have two blades next to each other available. This can reach the cords. Reach for this one. 